All right, good morning, people. This is gonna be a quick video on how to bypass your air pump for your rear suspension on a BMW 535 E61. You can see right there, it's a station wagon. The sedans do not have the airbag suspension, but the wagons do. So I only found a few little sources and it was really kind of difficult to piece everything together, wherein it's actually really simple. So you can see here, I took off my wheel just to really get visible access. So back here, so you can see this whole black block here with the red and blue going into it. And then there's a plug going into it there too. So that is uh, an electronic controlled valve that has the pressure feeding in the back. And then it feeds out the red and the blue for the right and the left. You have to open up that valve to be able to get pressure here to your airbags right there to be able to manually pump them up with an air compressor or otherwise. So you could f come in here and cut wires and mess with all that if you want. Um, but I didn't want to cut this because I might get the module and replace the stock system. So that wire comes up into the wheel well, comes into this loom, and it comes all the way down here. This is the plug. Now I pulled out of the white housing. But this is the plug um, that... Uh, your module plugs into my module is bad however the three cables that are down there are the blue with gray the blue with black and it's an orange with a brown line the orange with the brown is your negative and the two blues are your positives and it's the positive for the left and positive for the right so all you have to do is find those pins and jump them i i use some wires this pin was rusty so i pulled it out and just wrapped the um, copper around that to get connection. Um, the other two pins were good, so I used some spare wire, shoved it in the pins, and now you can see I have my positive connected, and whenever I connect my negative, make sure I'm not gonna jump anything bad. Whenever I connect the negative, you can hear it. And that's the valve opening and closing. Then you would come down here. So right here on the back, this is underneath um, from the rear bumper. Um, this is your air pump. There's a hose that comes in to right here. Um, now when, you're, when the air pump runs, it pushes pressure out of here. And this hose goes up to that relay block we just looked at. Now all I did was jump it. Um, I had these little T connectors. Um, and was able to connect the hoses. I have some spare hose here. And then this is just a standard bicycle valve, whatever, car, air valve. So now I can open that relay and pump air um, and be able to fill the airbags manually. Um, I'm going to try and fish this, I think, up into my trunk so I don't have to dig under the car. Um, at least for the temporary fix. So that should be a good understanding now of how to open the relay and how to be able to attach air fittings here to pump air and manually pump up your airbags on an E61.